easiest way to make a beautiful balloon garland arch. Hi, my name is Tabitha and I'm here with Party Dash. The first thing you want to do is make sure you have balloons on hand. The second thing is you're going to want a hand pump and preferably an electric air pump. The next thing here is actually a decorative strip. What we now have is heavy duty glue dots. And this is going to be important when you go to uh, insert your smaller balloons and the spaces and the gaps for that balloon arch to give it a full look. And then last but not least, we have wall hooks here. You can also use command strips. Now the wall hooks, these are necessary to help you hang your balloon garden arch. You would have one pile for your big balloons and another pile for your smaller balloons. Blow them all up, but keep them in separate piles because what's going to happen is we're going to put the larger balloons on the strip first and then we're going to use those heavy duty glue dots we talked about to fill in the gaps in the spaces to make sure it is just beautiful and completely filled out. All right, so let's get started. All right, so what I did here is I intentionally over uh, pumped this balloon to make a point. This is actually a pear shape. No, 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 you don't want this pear shape, guys. What you actually want is to let out a little air if this happens, and trust me, it will happen. And what you're aiming for is for the balloon to be about three-fourths full and for it to have this beautiful symmetrical round shape. And the purpose for that is going to give you some extra pull here to help tie the end. Don't be afraid to have a dance <laughs> We are now going to install them on this decorative balloon strip. If you take a look here, there's actually holes in this plastic strip. The benefit of it being clear is that all the tension will be on your colorful balloons, not what's holding them together. And the other nice thing is because these holes are already punctured or already in place, this makes it super easy. So what you're gonna do is just take your balloon, the tail of this balloon, and pull it directly through the hole on this decorative strip. All right, so you have done an incredible job putting the balloons on this decorative strip. There's a bit of exposure here. So we're gonna to wanna to add a balloon, a small one. And you can choose any color you want. It's really based off your preference. This is really the time to bring out that heavy duty glue dots we've been talking about. All you simply wanna do is layer that on the balloon. What you wanna do next, and, and this is optional. Some people put both at the same time. Some people go back later. For this purposes, I'm going to put both on. And what we're gonna do is make sure that glue adheres to a bigger balloon. And boom. And that is the magic of video editing. It is the next day, and I'm going to show you how to hang the balloon arch. I noticed a lot of videos skip this really important step, and it was the bane of my existence the first time I created one of these bad boys. You're gonna need about three or so hooks. We talked about this in the beginning of the video. Um, and we're gonna actually, let's see here. Take the, this part here is gonna be sticky. You want your hook hanging down, and you want to hang them in three locations, one uh, to the left, center, center a little bit higher, and then just for demonstration purposes, you literally just peel this off. It's that simple. And then over here to the right. Okay, so now you have your hooks placed on your wall or wherever you like to hang your balloon garland arch. What you're gonna need now is string, scissors, and if you're a shorty like me, a step stool. And all you're gonna do is take your string, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut enough to tie a loop around the decorative strip. This is a really important step because the balloons, think about it guys, the, the size, the sheer size of the balloon is so big, you can't hang this to the wall. You need a string to tie the decorative strip to the hook. So to speed things up, I've already done that step. And what we're gonna do is take this loop 
And all we're going to do is hook it. Link it on the hook here. Okay, so we now have the balloon gong arch hung to the wall. Take a few of the extra smaller balloons and glue dots you have left over and fill in any space that's sparse. And just like that, you've created a beautiful balloon garland arch. Good job to you. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you found it helpful at all, please like and subscribe to our channel. And more importantly, share this video with friends and family that may have a party coming up. Also, if you go to party-dash.com right now, you'll actually find this balloon garden arch along with a host of different beautiful hand curated uh, party balloon garden arches that are ready to go with everything in the kit, including a step-by-step -step instruction guide. Thanks so much for checking this out. See you next time.